In the light of Trump's election victory, British Defence Minister John Healy has tried to quell European concerns about the continuity of American support for NATO and Ukraine in the middle of the ongoing conflict in uh, Ukraine with Russia. And speaking on Sky News just now, Healy has said uh, that uh, he has a vision of steadfast transatlantic unity, underscoring that Trump, despite his reputation for unpredictability, recognizes the security for nations uh, that stems from collective strength, a strength exemplified by alliances such as NATO. Reassurance uh, is pivotal at this juncture, especially given Trump's mixed historical rhetoric towards NATO and Russia, where at times he sharply critiqued member nations for their insufficient defence contributions. Healy, addressing these past ambiguities, has reiterated his belief that Trump's underlying commitment to NATO's foundational purpose remains unshaken. Indeed, He's pointed out that even during Trump's previous administration, the U.S. did not withdraw from the alliance, but instead reinforced the principle that defense obligations are a shared burden. They, the U.S., uh, recognize the importance of this alliance, Healy has said, reminding viewers that Trump's approach aligns with the doctrine of strength, one that seeks to forestall further European conflict through robust allied cohesion. And Trump's prior insistence on increased European defence spending, which once sounded alarms across the continent, now appears prescient as leaders in Europe acknowledge the necessity of greater investment. And Healy concurs with Trump's push for Europe to amplify its role. European nations in NATO need to do more of the heavy lifting, he said, signalling a convergence of strategic aims between Washington and London and this perspective, while potentially challenging, doesn't imply abandonment. Instead, it reinforces shared responsibilities within the alliance. Healy's comments arrive at a time when Russia's aggression in Ukraine continues to test NATO's resolve. And the British Defence Minister's assurance that Trump will persist in standing by Ukraine for as long as it takes echoes the broader commitment shared by allied nations. While speculation and criticism and uh, and scepticism surround Trump's foreign policy uh, and his intentions, Healy's intervention seeks to project a message of continuity and strength. And NATO, with its collective defence mandate, remains central to US-European security. And Trump's return, Healy insists, is unlikely to diminish that fundamental tenet. So while European capitals may hold memories of Trump's contentious remarks on alliances in the past, Healy's confirmation is a timely reminder that enduring global realities underpinned by mutual security interests transcend individual policy shifts and diversity. The dialogue therefore pivots not on an expectation of disruption, but on reinforced collaboration calibrated to meet the daunting challenges posed by aggressors like President Putin.